All right, guys, recording is on. I know I just went through everything that we're going to be doing, um, and I will do it again in just a couple minutes, but right now, just going to let you guys know what's happening here. We're just getting the stuff out of the mega boxes. So, I'm going to get everything out of these pain in the butts real quick. Help us expedite our process. A lot of boxes to open today. What is it, 15, 30, 31 total boxes in this break. And then we have, uh, I've got a football break after this with another one, 10 boxes, nine boxes, something like that. So, every little minute or two helps me. Wyatt, you got the uh, the Bayron Laura spot, didn't you, buddy? That is a big one. 16 boxes of Sapphire. I mean, that should be at least at least four Lauras, I would hope, for you. Which is, you know, 300 bucks coming back. Just like that. Worst case scenario. Forget about all the other Lauras you're going to get from uh, Mega and, uh, and Hobby and parallels and all that fun stuff. So congrats on uh, drilling that spot, dude. Pays for like, I know you get bought a bunch of spots and you get eight or something like that. But uh, yeah, it feels nice when you hit the spot like that in the Laura. You know, cover almost all your spots, guaranteed just um, <laughs> on the base cards that you're gonna drill, so. That's why Bowman's awesome. Bowman in prison and stuff like that, where you only have to worry really about the hits. The hits are just kind of like extra. So. Oh, that's what's going to happen, dude. You're going to get at least four. I mean, we're opening 16 boxes of Sapphire. You should get at least four. Um, you know, even if uh, even if you get unlucky and hit three, um, I, I can't imagine getting less than that. And then through five boxes of Chrome, you should get a couple, hopefully a couple parallels. Same thing with Mega Box, so should be a, a good afternoon for you, my friend. of the break down there where it's still in view of the camera um so we're gonna start with these guys get them out of the way but real fast um all right it's gonna be time to do the rules now i guess now that we're ready to uh to get started okay guys so for this break it's a little bit different uh, a little bit uh, more complicated than your normal player break player random um just because i uh i thought it was probably a better idea um, to kind of give it a little bit more value with the, uh, the format that I came up with here, this, uh, draft random hybrid. So, um, we already have all of our random players assigned. Um, as we're going through, I'm going to do my best, um, to separate the, uh, the players that are not part of the original 150 card Bowman checklist that are going to be part of the draft portion as we go. Um, but at the end, um, 
what we'll do is collectively, uh, we know there's gonna be four extra spots for all the inserts and stuff that are assigned, but um, collectively as we're going through, uh, it's, we're gonna have to work as a team here to make sure we identify all the autos that are gonna be part of the draft. Um, most of them are pretty obvious. There might be one or two that I forget. Um, I'm sure you guys will help me out there. But we'll have those set aside, the autographs, and then um, as soon as the break is done, before I start my next break, um, the first thing that we'll do is we will do that draft, uh, draft random. So um, we'll go in, I'll randomize the list, and if there winds up being six autos plus the four spots, the top ten people in that full random are going to be the ones who get to draft. Um, the draft is going to be very, very laid back. It's, I'm not going to be like, you know, 15 minutes to draft like we would a normal draft. Um, I'm going to set like a one hour limit between picks and I'm just going to trust that you guys are going to be at least remotely efficient in making your picks because um, it's not that many spots. I, I just don't have time to spend an hour and a half policing that draft. Um, so uh, I appreciate everyone being um, punctual and uh, paying attention once we get that started. So, for the break itself, um, we're going to start off here with our Bowman Mega Box, non Mega Box packs. Um, just a reminder um, only the Chrome stuff is shipping, no paper is shipping at all. Um, I did my best. I gave you guys, a, I think, a, an extra $2 off per spot um, than what was normal. Um, and I'm just going to put all the papers in a box here. Um, the shipping would have just been too much, the sorting wouldn't have made it worth it. Um, so, I hope that you guys took advantage of the additional spot price with uh, almost a full full discount of the shipping and supplies um, for that. So that's uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, after the regular Bowman Mega Box, non-Mega Pack, we're going to move to the Bowman Hobby, then we're going to move into the Mega Box Packs, and then we're going to finish with Sapphire at the end. So that'll be the order. I'm assuming it'll take us maybe an hour and a half, hour, 45 minutes, maybe a little bit longer to get through all of it. Um, and then from there, I know there's probably a couple of you guys here now, we're going to move into 16 Optic Football, a little throwback to the first year of uh, shiny football stuff. Uh, in the optic brand so that's going to be a fun one um and that's uh that's going to do it for me me telling you what's going to happen so uh enough talk more coffee and let's uh let's go ahead and get into it all right guys so i'm just gonna i'm gonna tear through an entire stack both of these stacks and just stack them up um because we're only looking at two cards per pack in here so Good luck, everyone. Maybe we grab a couple of uh, Dominguez and some of the big names here to start off with. That'll be fantastic. Um, also, if anyone uh, is, um, you know, out there thinking of uh, some breaks that they'd like to, to see me do, please reach out to me. I'd be happy to, uh, to look into anything. I'm going to be putting up another Bowman something of some sort. Uh, looking at the prices, I think um, it's going to be uh, heavy on Megabox to be honest, because they are the only ones that really haven't exploded in price. Sapphire is great, um, don't get me wrong, but I think I would rather have 10 mega boxes as opposed to one box of Sapphire, personally. That's just me, but we'll see. Um, plus, the mega box checklist is tighter. Um, you don't have all 150 prospects. They weed out uh, a bunch of them. I think there's only 100 different people in that set, so um, we can kind of get a little bit better of a player selection by doing one of those. So we might be doing some, something cool like, you know, 50 boxes of that and then toss in like a, you know, a couple Sapphire and then um, a couple Hobbies or something. I, I don't know. i got to play with the numbers, but yeah, dude, Steve, 16 Optic is going to be sweet. I'm actually very excited for that. I hope we get one of the hot boxes. It was funny, when I was doing the uh, the random results, I'm like, you know, looking to see, I'm putting everyone's teams in and whatever. I'm like, I can't even remember. Ah! Hold on, guys, I think I lost internet. All right, I think I'm back. All right, I think I'm back. Sorry about that, guys. Lost internet there for all of one millisecond. Um, but what I was saying was, Steve, uh, when I was going through and typing out the random results, just looking at all the teams, and I was like, oh, what team is this? What team is Like, just trying to remember all the, the rookies. I'm sitting there, I'm like, Titans. I'm like, oh, my God, Taewon Taylor. 
I'm like, Vikings, oh no, Moritz Boehringer. <laughs> Just like all these names that have haunted me uh, for years. So it's going to be a fun break. I hope we avoid uh, those guys, though, to be honest. But um, if you guys can do me a favor, if anyone's watching, can just type uh, anything into the chat. Just let me know that you can see, okay, I lost internet there for um, all of that 20 seconds. I just want to make sure uh, it is streaming okay for you guys. Por favor, gracias de nada. Doing good in Duolingo, by the way, for those of you that don't care, which is all of you. Um, crushing it right now. Got like a hundred gold crowns. I can like say sentences and stuff. Like it's pretty nice with it. I'm like you know one percent fluent. So you know just humble brag. Since no one's typed anything, uh, as soon as I finish these packs, I'm just going to pop into the actual YouTube feed. Because um, the chat might have, uh, the chat feature might just be completely disrupted and offline now that I, uh, I lost internet. It happens every once in a while when that occurs. So let me just do that right quick. Yeah. All right. So what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to uh, I'm gonna have to do this. Give me one second, guys. Let me just fiddle with this a little bit so that way I can uh. See the chat over here. Cause I lost it on my uh, my main editor. Okay, yeah, I missed a whole bunch of stuff. So let me uh, real fast. What's up, Chris? Sorry about your video freeze. Now it's probably on my end, not yours. Um, what's up, Dana? Uh, I see the chat, Rory. Thank you. Okay, good. All right. All right, all right, I think we're all good now. Now I can see everything. Getting a little bootleg here with uh, my setup, but all right, here we go. Just gonna go right into it. Uh, we're doing the Chromes only, so let's see. <laughs> well, that's how you start a break. What's up? First card. Dominguez. Awesome. <laughs> well, Dana, come on. I mean, didn't you know? You're not supposed to buy spots. You have to you have to make a you have to make demands. You say, I want three spots plus the first card in the break. And I would have said, yeah, whatever, who cares? Stupid one card. And you would have got yourself a Dominguez. That's the rule. And we do that a lot. Just like first card, just drill exactly what we're looking for. But all right, so Dominguez and Gilbert. Balazovic and Jung. Hunter Green, Tyler Freeman. Langoliers and Chisholm. Adam Hall, Forrest Whitley. Luis Gill, Christian Javier. Jacob Amaya and Antonio Cabello. There's Alora for you, Wyatt. And Valamont, Ryan Rollison, and Jaron Duran. Uh, Montero and Denneberg. Welker and Nova. Baz and John Diaz. Cannon Smith, Adam Hall. Gill and Ruiz. Javier and Amaya. J Rod and Hunter Green. Freeman and Joe Ryan. 
Davidson and Cabrian Hayes. Madrigal and Stott. Gunnar Henderson and Nate Pearson is going to do it for the first half of our Mega Box nonsense packs. Edwards and Brennan Davis. Nice little grouping there. Robinson and Volpe. Garcia and Riley Green. Mize and Dahlbeck. Gorman and Gilbert. Mendoza and Boz. Smith and Pearson. Lutz and Mauricio. Dunning, Cabello. Waters and Howard. Manoa and Garcia. Pache and Wynn. Kate and Rutledge. Carlson and Kirilov. Shortridge and Little. Anderson and Encarnacion. Very nice. Bobby Witt. So we got Witt, Laura, and Dominguez all out of the nonsense pack, so that's very nice. Trammell and Adele. Bart and Jones. Wow. Double Dominguez. First and last pack. Look at that. What a start for the Dominguez spot. Chris, I know you're out there, buddy. I know you're out there watching somewhere. But great start for you, my friend. Congrats. And I'm going to be uh, soft sleeving actually a couple of these guys as we go. Just the big, big guys. Um, my wife will be sorting. She knows what she's doing, but... Where'd you go, Bobby Witt? A couple of the bigger base, which normally I wait till the end to sleeve. Uh, I'm going to sleeve as we go. That way wifey knows uh, extra special care. All right, forgive me as I move all this stuff. I didn't have a four row box, unprepared. I thought I had an empty one here. Apparently not, I left it in the office. So I'm gonna have to manually move this stuff as we go. So apologies, slowing us down a little bit. All right. We're going to move on to Bowman Hobby now. First of five boxes. The other ones, I don't know if you can see. There they are in the top uh, top left side of your screen. Draw from a fresh case. Just grab five. So again, we're going to just fly through and go right to the chrome stuff. Um, unless it is a numbered paper card. Hey, Rutledge is nice, dude. It's a top 20 guy right there. I love me some Jackson Rutledge. And I pull a lot of Rutledge. I think I pulled Rutledge Gold, Rutledge Orange, uh, I think a Rutledge Atomic. He's one of the guys that I happen to pull a lot of. Getting ready here with uh, box number one of Hobby. All 
All right, good luck, guys. Singer and Varland. Uh, Kirilov insert. Dunning and Duran. Oh, I hope that not every card is upside down. That's annoying. Hernandez insert. Waters and De La Cruz. Uh, just a reminder, any of the inserts, if the player is in the BP1 to 150 set, it will go to that spot. If it is not in that set, it will be part of the draft selection. So if, uh, I don't think we've got one yet, but when we get one, I will show you guys. Chisholm and Poisson. Bo like for this example, for, the, for uh, this for example, Bobichette, not in BP1 to 150. This will go into the insert spot uh, that's going to be drafted uh, at the end. Mitchell and Scooble, Yu Chang, Kate, and Lodolo. Dylan Cease, Ashby, and John Diaz. Talent Pipeline of the Braves, Kalenic and Ruiz. Uh, top 100 of Gilbert, Campusano, and Amaya. Uh, insert of Scherzer. Floriel and Adams, Talent Pipeline of the Angels, Robert and Bojarski, Top 100 of Corbin Carroll, Langoliers, and Sam Huff. Luciano insert, and Alec Baum, paper to $4.99, Carlson and Nova, Grayson Rodriguez insert, Encarnacion and Gilbert, Lazardo insert, Franco and Pearson Chromes, Cedric Mullins insert, Rollison and Sanchez, Ramos insert, Mateo and McConnell, Adele insert, Holsizer and Nolan Jones. And our last stack here in box one, got a shimmer coming up. Kirilov and Joey Bart to 125. Nate Pearson insert, Shortridge and Joe Ryan, O'Neill Cruz insert, Bomb and Pardino, hey wifey, Bayron Laura, a Daniel Lynch Atomic, Liz Lizardo insert, Valamont and Gonzalez, no way we got short in auto first box, right? No, okay, thank God. Lindsey Delgado is our auto. Ian Anderson and Bryson Stott. And I believe Lency Delgado is not in the set. He's going to go um, into the, the draft. Not a lot so far, just this little stack. I had to do a bunch of talking. It's just this little stack so far. So you this? Just, yeah. Not that? No. No, ma'am. Careful. They slippery. It's you chrome. Know how to handle I know you do, girl. Okay. I'm just telling you. It's chrome. It's slippery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Dane, I'm definitely doing the podcast, 100%. Um, I just need to finalize uh, some stuff. But I, mean, I can tell you guys. Um, I think what I'm going to be doing is um, I'm going to be kind of changing what I do for the company a little bit um, and limiting my hours um, working on eBay in order to do a little bit more breaking for uh, the company as like a, another channel. Um, you know, we already have Houdini and Matt, uh, but I think I'm gonna be kind of a third channel. Um, I'll have my own sub forum and everything. This pack is fat as hell, what the hell? What on? Well, that's weird. I don't know what's going on. This pack is fat, and it's got an orange refractor as the second card with a, a damaged front card, then an orange refractor, and insert, and two chromes. All right, that's interesting. Um, but, yeah, I will definitely be doing um, at least a once-a-week once podcast is what I'm uh, aiming for to start until I can kind of uh, <laughs> learn how to video edit a little bit better. Um, but I'll be covering many, uh, many a different topic. We have two oranges in this box, by the way, guys. An orange and an orange shimmer so far here in the first stack. Uh, covering many a topic, though. Um, ranging from uh, grading. I know a lot about that. Uh, <laughs> products. Uh, common sense. I think the name of my pod podcast is going to be Don't Be Stupid. Um, 
So basically, I'm just going to teach you guys how not to make mistakes and how to think the right way to uh, to be good at cards. I mean, you can you can enjoy cards. Thanks, Dana. I'm sure I'll do fine. I've never really uh, never really had an issue with anything I've ever decided to do. I think I'm pretty good at the stuff that I try, but um, I appreciate that. But yeah, I'm going to kind of kind of going to share with you guys the stuff that I've learned doing this uh, my whole life. Um, very high level, you know, obviously works with a lot of cards. One of the, uh, if not the preeminent uh, company in the business. Kayla, how's it going? How your dog's doing? How do puppies? Um, so yeah, I got a, I got a lot of good ideas here. Uh, Prison, I can talk forever about basketball, so it's going to be hard for me to make sure I don't just talk about basketball nonstop. Um, but it'll be stuff such as, you know, just tips. Buy this player, don't buy this player, you know, uh, trajectory stuff. You know, you look at this guy, like what he's on pace to do compared to other players. A lot of the hobby is just comparing. Um, comparing and contrasting, you know, like you got this player here who's actually doing this, and we compare him to a player who's, you know, Proving what he can do, not not just based off potential and stuff like that, and it's it's a very very unique market in the fact that we pay for expectations which are usually unrealistic, um, as opposed to paying for actual actual production. So, no, that's not great, Kayla. I'm sorry to hear that. My grandfather passed um, right after Christmas this year, so wasn't the greatest week for us, but he made it to Christmas, so that was, I was happy. Got to see him one more time. My grandma's birthday was yesterday, too. She's like 93, 94, and wow, I'm blurry. Well, that'll fix itself in a minute, but all right. Here we go with the first stack here in box two. Lynch insert, Cardenas and De La Cruz, Cease insert, Cruz, or uh, O'Neill Cruz and Casas, Pipeline of the uh, Tigers, Apostle and Whitley, Puck insert, Edwards and Cabello, Robinson and Garcia, Anderson insert, Volpe and Kraus, Wander Franco insert, Cruz and Levine. I'm really excited to get to that weird pack, the double orange stack over there too. Um, Parita spanning the globe, Gray and Duran, Bichette insert, Marquez and Varland, Kershaw insert, Pache and Pearson, Cardinals uh, pipeline, Win and Diaz. Casas, Cancio and Ruiz. Missing chrome cards? Sounds weird. Rushman and Amaya. Larnich, insert. Campusano and Lodolo. Singer. And there's a nice atomic for the John Diaz spot. John Diaz. Very nice. Lazardo insert. Dunning and Nova. Muncie, insert. Waters and Ryan, Garcia insert, Howard and Stott, Casey Mize, Manoa and Gilbert. Oh, nice. Well, happy early birthday. I got a good friend whose birthday is Friday as well. I think two of them are actually Friday. I think maybe it's Thursday, Friday. All right, Orange Shim Shim coming up. Hunter Bishop and, ooh, a nice one. J.J. Bladé. Second year, but still very nice. For the Mariners, so this is the weird one that was uh, had the extra card in the pack, had it, an extra chrome card. But it was a nice one. Blade, Orange Shimmer to 25. Bo Bichette rookie, Mata and Perez. And our auto, never fails, Adam Hall. Adam Hall auto. So he is in the base set, so he will not be drafted. Pena and Pereira. Miguel Amaya. Abrams and Little. And our other orange, nice. So this is a draftable card. Kyle Lewis, rookie. The 1990 Bowman, 9 of 25. Oh, driver's license, big year. Big year for you, kid. Hall, top 100. Vaughn and Rutledge. It's going to do it for box two. So we had the Lewis in the draft spot. The Hall auto. Lede, Shimmer to 25, and a nice John Diaz Atomic. On to box three. And 
bottom camera does not like me today. I'm just like straight up like Medusa. In there. Broke it. It's too ugly. Broke the camera. Wah, wah. Matt and Bowman Hobby is just a grind. Absolute grind to open this set. It's funny because when you're... I always get excited for like the five or ten cases of Bowman Hobby I do every year. But then like after that, like after that like initial like surge of a... Uh, you know like getting excited to see all the new prospects and all that stuff and the new design. After that it's just like... Whew! It is a painful, painful rip. I think we got another orange. It might have been paper. Couldn't tell. I think it is paper. All right. Aquino insert. Short Ridge and Jones. Pipeline of the Angels, Anderson and Adams. Uh, Jackson Coe, our insert, Jaron Encarnacion and Bojarski, and our orange paper. Nice, a rookie, Adrian Morjan. So that will be drafted. Rookie to 25. Franco and Huff. Pete Alonzo, insert. Ashby and Poisson. Very nice there. Alzale, insert. Kalenic and Skubal. Rushman insert, Blade and Liberator. Hankins and Aaron Shortridge, another one of my homies for life. Aaron Shortridge. As long as this product exists, I will pull Aaron Shortridge. This bottom camera is driving me nuts. Like, what are you focused on? Pay attention to me. Look at me. Kyle Lewis insert, India and Nick Allen. Cantillo insert, Lewis and Astudio. Greater all insert, Bomb and Paredes, Victor Victor Mesa insert, very nice Bayron Laura, second one of those, and Hernandez. There's a nice Dominguez insert, Kirilov and McConnell, India insert, and a sky blue of Adaman. So that will go to the. Um, That'll actually go to Adamin. The only uh, draftable spots for the paper are the numbered uh, rookies and veterans. Langoliers and White. Chisholm. And a Joey Cantillo. Aqua, 28 of 125 on the Cantillo. AJ Puck. Mitchell and Perdino. And our autograph. Rookie card logo. So it's going to get drafted. A guy that I like. Performed very well at all levels. Ison Diaz. Ison Diaz. So, very nice card. Native of Bayomon, Puerto Rico. My favorite place on earth, Puerto Rico. I haven't been many places, but I like that one the best. Uh, Kate and Gonzalez. Sheffield. Carlson and Jesus Sanchez. Bojarski spanning the globe, Robert and Beck. 
Pole Sizer and Cameron, Brendan McKay. Floriel and Vargas. Alec Baum insert. Valamont and Jones. Pipeline of the D backs. Rollison and Hill. Kyle Wright. Mateo and Mountcastle. That's going to do it for box number three. What's up, Purge? Yeah, this is uh, this is going to be a little bit of a long break for baseball. Uh, a lot of Bowman, 31 total boxes here, but we're getting through the uh, the slower portion of it, which is the hobby boxes. Um, we're almost done here. We're on box number four right now. So, um, also Dana, I know uh, you had mentioned about the podcast. If anyone has any ideas, stuff they want me to cover in podcast, um, I could literally cover almost anything. I used to be a sports writer um, briefly when I was at the University of Delaware. Um, and I pretty much know all all aspects of all sports and the cards. Um, working on working on soccer. That's the only thing. I mean, I played travel soccer for years growing up, but I don't I don't follow the EPL and La Liga and Series A and Bundesliga and all that stuff um, just because of the time difference. Hard to hard to watch. Um, but big World Cup guy though. Love the World Cup. Uh, but yeah, if anyone wants me to any topics they would like to hear my insight on. Literally anything from grading to product reviews to uh, investments to you know, hype players, player comparisons, print runs, you know, you name it, I, I know about it. So I'm always open to ideas. I think I've got an idea for the first, uh, the first one that I'm going to do. It's going to be a very basic one. Uh, but once we uh, once we cover, I think it's probably the first two. I think I need two uh, two podcasts to kind of cover uh, all the basic things, kind of give you guys like a uh, gloss your glossary of terms and uh, all that fun stuff that you need to understand. That way you don't you know dive headfirst into one of my podcasts and have no idea what the hell I'm talking about because you don't know the words that I'm using. You don't know the industry terms. So it'll probably take me one episode to do that, and then another episode to uh, probably explain grading, because um, that's that's always going to be such a centralized topic um, in any discussion. You know, you can talk about you can grading relates to literally every aspect of the uh, the hobby these days. So um, that's kind of what I think I'm going to do for episodes one and two, and then uh, episode three, depending on what live sports are going on, if there are any. Um, I'll probably uh, I'll probably start right off out the gate by hooking you guys up with a uh, a good buy. Find something that's uh, undervalued. I know that those of you guys that have been in my breaks for a long time, uh, I don't know if you, um, maybe you've noticed, maybe not, but um, a lot of the things that I break that I recommend, uh, we can break them a little bit and then they go up by two hundred dollars in price on the website. Not my fault, I swear, um, but I'm pretty good at identifying stuff that is undervalued, but cool. Yeah, uh, baseball prospecting is a very, very in-depth one. That might be like a monthly, like a once a month, like, you know, my, uh, my prospect perspective or something like that. I don't know. Um, but prospecting is easy for me. Um, the general things that I follow. The hard part is the unknown. I'll, I'll leave it at that. There is a uh, an unknown aspect to prospecting, um, which makes things difficult. But we'll save that for one of the episodes. Um, but everything else, the numbers are easy. It's the uh, the other stuff that makes it difficult. All right, box four: Aquino insert, Montero and Davis, Drew Waters insert, Green and Liberator, Munoz, Freeman and Allen, Trammell and Casas. Brendan McKay, Joe Adele and Whitley, the San Brown insert, Bart and Cabello. I think it's fairly obvious that the uh, first stack that I, I do in every box is the trash one here. It seems like that in every single uh, every single case. One one row of packs literally just has nothing. No numbered cards, no parallels, no ins or uh, nothing but inserts. Um, Lewis insert, Manning and Varland, 
Varsho insert, Cavaco and Adamin, Patino insert, Gore and Beer, Balazovic insert, Terang and Duran, Casey Mize insert, Bennett and De La Cruz, Luis Robert insert, Luciano and Perez. Uh, Yankees Pipeline, Denneberg and Riley Green, Kyle Lewis insert, Thompson and Pereira, Talent Pipeline of the Cubs, Wilson and Rutledge. Putting guys in the wrong stack. What am I doing? Uh, Matt Manning insert, nice Bobby Witt, second Bobby Witt, Grant Little, Shane Boz insert, Welker and Hose, and for the draftable spots, Seth Brown, Sky Blue to four ninety nine, J Rod and Garcia. All right, should have our auto floating around someone here. We got a purple coming up, Brady Singer insert, and our purple, nice one for the Dodgers, Kiebert Ruiz, one sixty three of two fifty. It's the paper. Thomas and Garcia. Groshans. And there's a nice one. I think this is also uh, Gardner Motors. I think he hit Dominguez and Volpe. 146 of 150 on the blue Volpe. Abrams insert. Rutherford and Kraus. Fuck me. Are you kidding me? I hate this guy. I hate this guy. Is there another Joe Janord out there in the world beside one that comes from my basement? I don't think there is. I just, I can't believe this. You stink. Ugh. There you go, Chris. You asked for it. Draftable autos. <laughs> Man, I hate Joe Janord. <laughs> that was Lynch and Levine, McKenzie insert, Schmidt and Amaya. Grayson Rodriguez, and finishing off with a Colton Welker Atomic. Wow. That is just miraculous, the amount of Joe Janord autos we hit. It's unbelievable. That's got to be the 10th one. Like, no, no joke. That's got to be 10 Joe Janords. I don't believe you, Steve. I think you're lying. I'm, I, you know what? Not only do I think you're I'm going to call you a liar to your internet face. You're a liar because no one can pull Joe Janord except me. That's the first rule of box breaks. You know those signs? Like when you go to someone's house and they have like one of those signs that says like, Steelers fan parking only. When you, you know, enter their, like, you know, like, sports room or whatever. Yeah, this is the Joe Janord parking only. They only made one sign because only one person needed it. It's me. Oh, my goodness. Well. <laughs> I am not lying. Man, I don't like Joe Janord. Odd too. It seems like uh, I know when we were opening um, Bowman Hobby uh, when we were doing the multi case breaks. A couple of you guys were telling me that Houdini had a couple cases. Yeah, I know. I don't know why it's not focusing. It's for some reason the autofocus is like way way up front, and I just can't fix it. So I tried to, but it's. It'll correct itself at some point. It always does, but it's not going to be right now. But I appreciate the heads up, uh, SCM. But uh, I know some of you guys were saying when we were doing the Bowman Hobby that uh, Houdini had a couple cases where it... Um, and Ice on Diaz, Abe. What's up, Abe, by the way? Um, you guys were saying that Houdini had a couple cases where uh, he didn't get many numbered cards. It looks like this is going to be one of those, or, well, came from one of those. Because the ones that, the case that we opened, I mean, I think we didn't have more than four base autos in a whole case, and now we've hit four out of four boxes. So, yeah, I know you get, you're going to live 
with uh, the, the camera being fuzzy. I know it's all right, but it, it does it does annoy me. Uh, I don't know why it happens. So, oh, you know, man, I'm just chilling. Saying I did like so many errands today. I worked like a double uh, a double day yesterday because I didn't have uh, any breaks or anything to do. So, um, oh, nice, you got the haul. Sweet, good start. Um, yeah, I didn't. I didn't so I worked like probably 13 hours yesterday, just uh, listing cards and stuff for the company. So I was able to take it a little bit easy today. Cut the grass, wash the cars, water the flowers, you know, man stuff, just dude stuff. Then I went and listed more cards, watched the Raptors beat the crap out of the Celtics the day after Christmas. That was a fun game. Uh, yeah, it was my day. Here we are with our fifth and final box of Bowman Hobby before we move into the, uh, we'll call it the more fun stuff. Gonna have to take a second after this box to, uh, to clean up here. But yeah, so far we only have one auto that is going to a spot, which is the Adam Hall. Uh, eBay username is Blowout Cards 2. Blowout Cards and number two. Most of the stuff I was listing was uh, some just cheaper stuff. Uh, like all stuff that was between like six and 20 bucks. Uh, I got boxes and boxes of that stuff here that have been on backlog, mainly basketball and football was the stuff uh, recently. I did I did about 200 baseball, though, like last week, so. All right, here we go. Gunnar Henderson and Nate Pearson. Luis Robert insert. Miller and Diaz. Ramos insert. Hoke and Ruiz. Oh, yes! Yes, 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 yes. All right, how how big is this card going to be? Well, I can tell you it's colorful. I can see some kind of color. Chris, you watching, man? Are you in here, Chris? I think I think it's purple. It is. Jersey number, 132 of 250. Boom! If it was the Super, I would have shit myself. Like, I would have done that on camera for you guys. I would have in, in my pants a little bit on camera if this was the Super Auto. Still pretty damn good. Pretty damn good, lads. Alright, 30 second break. Gotta get a magnetic... So taking a look at it real quick, it's got a little surface mark and it's a little tiny bit off center left to right. Uh, the auto has a tiny streak, but all things considered, uh, not too bad for him, for Dominguez. But there it is, guys. It's going to be hard to top that. Congrats, Chris. I don't think you're watching because I'm sure you would have said something. But um, Scooble and Sejas. Robinson, Ramos and Lodolo, Pardino insert, Tavares and Nova. I'll tell you what, I'll make that trade every single day. If we get a Genora, that means we're going to hit a color Dominguez the next box. Done deal. A Riley Green insert, Cruz and Gonzalez, Pipeline of the uh, Padres, Apostle and Sanchez, Lazardo insert, Edwards McConnell, Alzale insert, Mata and Vargas, and Paddock insert, Pena and Beck, uh, J Rod insert, Vaughn and White, Amaya insert, Abrams and Pardino, Horner insert, nice Dominguez right there, good Dominguez box for you, Chris, Joe Ryan. Pipeline of the Rays, Balazovic and Stott, Mata insert, Jung and Gilbert, Riley Green insert, Mize and Huff, 
Dahlbeck and a Zach Brown purple to 250. One second there, sweetie. J Rod insert, Sanchez and Poisson. You can take the box lid and then just bring it back downstairs. Cool. Robinson and Nolan Jones. Brennan Rogers insert. Cardenas and Cameron. Hunter Bishop. And Gus Varland Atomic. May insert, Volpe and Adams, Franco spanning the globe, Garcia and Bojarski is going to do it for Bowman Hobby. So very nice. I think we uh, ended up, I mean mainly it was nice for the Dominguez slot because Dominguez we obviously got the auto and then I think we wound up with three total chromes up to this point. Um... So very, very nice. And then the Volpe spot did okay, hitting the blue. Same guy though, Chris owns both. Chris has been on a tear with me uh, with the Yankees, starting off in uh, Bowman first edition. Mega box packs back on the table here. All right, we have time. Good luck, guys. Let's see if we can get something for someone who's not Chris. He's already killed this break. And I think he's going to continue to kill it because I saw a Bobby Witt, which means a Dominguez is probably right behind it. A quick fan job. Ooh, two autos. I don't think man, two autos and a green. It looks like, and one watch update. All right, good luck, guys. Cardenas, Edwards, Murphy insert, Carlson, Bomb, Whole Sizer, Rutledge, Alzel insert, McConnell, Levine, Manning, Kirloff, Bobuchet insert, Robert, Javier, Howard, Floriel, and first auto, Kyle Stowers. So that is going to be going to the draft spot. Probably, Chris. Probably right. He's going to have himself a good day. <laughs> Stower is 99.9% .9 sure this is going to the draftable auto spots. So good news for everyone on that second chance drawing. Another card for you guys to, to play with. Bojarski, Balzovich, Hill, Manning. And there's a nice one. Also going to the draft spots. Four of 99, Rookie of the Year favorites green, Jordan Alvarez. So that's another nice card. Aquino, Rookie of the Year favorite, Schmidt, Kirloff, and Howard in our second auto. Another one of my homies, Gunnar Henderson. Draft spot, crushing it. But Gunnar Henderson. There's only 29 autos in Hobby um, that 
don't have um that aren't in the the checklist so yeah Orioles killing it too Henderson Hall and uh Stowers but this one does have a home don't know who's got Gunnar Henderson but that is yours Bart Kraus Pena De La Cruz Lazardo insert Amaya very nice Bobby Witt Lade, Dunning, Lugo insert, and as predicted, another Dominguez for Chris, Gonzalez, Casas, Whitley, Murphy insert, Varland, Poisson. Very nice. Whitley, Pena, Munoz insert, Rushman, and Thomas. Very, very nice so far. Second half of the mega box. Let's see if we can get a couple more autos up in here, up in here. Definitely got something in this pack. I think. Might have been wrong. Felt fat. Felt like a big old fatty. Oh look, the camera fixed itself. I told you it would. Just took a minute. Took a minute to adjust. It's like looking into the sun, you know, like. There's no red. Pink's one. No, Pad Pratch is a Sapphire one one. This is 99, right? For I can't remember. Oh, pink is one. I think pink is 199 or 150. Not that rare. Just been a while since we've done Mega Box. Messing with me. All right, Beck, Kalenic. Abraham Toro insert, Trammell, Manoa, Jung, and our only thing look, to look forward to in this stack. Then off center, Aramis Adaman. I think is 199. The uh, the Sapphire Pad Paratches are the 101s. I just got them confused. Too many cards. Gorman, Green, Lewis, Cruz, Lazardo, J Rod, Lodolo, Shortridge, Hill, Patino insert, Henderson, Pache, Brown, Garcia, Murphy insert, Davidson, Rodriguez, Franco, Garcia, Robert spanning the globe, Lodolo, Henderson, Hill, Manning, Horner insert, Robert again, Javier, Kirilov, Howard, Lugo insert, Bojarski, Balasovic, Kirilov, Howard, Kyle Lewis insert, Bart, Kraus, Floriel, Casas, Patino, Mata, and Waters. All right. So that is going to do it for that. And then I'll bring a couple of the sapphire boxes up at a time. We got three, but uh, I'm just gonna open them individually. I'll do three boxes at a time. I'll take out all the packs and uh, stack them. And then we'll go through box by box. for at one time. We haven't gotten one yet at a sapphire. So we'll go one box at a time here. We'll stack them up and then uh, roll through them. And uh, as far as shipping goes to this break, uh, we'll do our best. Do our best here to get everything out as soon as possible. Um, there's a chance some of them get out tomorrow. There's a possibility that uh, it doesn't happen until Thursday, but it won't be later than that. Oh, who did you just hit, Chris? A pad paracha you're talking about? 
All right, box number one, no numbered card. Uh, Singer, Mauricio, Miller, Ashby, Pereira, Langoliers, Gill, Thomas, Kraus, Wilson, Franco, Welker, Thomas, Amaya, Ruiz, Cavico, Bishop, Huff, Balazovic, Baum, Beck, Mize, Brennan Davis, Swaggerty, Garcia, Hoke, Rollison, and Gray. Cruz, Volpe, Apostle, and our auto is... Nicobello for the draft spot. <laughs> Literally not memorable because you can't remember him from five minutes ago. <laughs> ah, funny stuff. All right, box two. Box two here with Sapphire. Sizer, Trammell, Sanchez, Joe Ryan, Hall, Pache, Carlson, Mountcastle, Hernandez. I know that run of people leads to a Dominguez. Where's my autofocus? Way up here. All right, Dominguez. There we go. Pearson, Dunning, J Rod, Valmont, Kalenic, Hill, Smith, Luciano, Blade, Davidson. Luis Robert, big card there. Astudio, Rushman, Campisano, Freeman, and McConnell. And I think I know who this is. Yep. Very distinct because of the border. But how about a Luis Robert to 20? What's up, Luis Robert spot? 13 of 20. Get you some, kid. Boom. I knew it right away because it's a different border. But that's a good one. Do you guys see the uh, the batting practice? Well, not batting practice. The inter-squad homer that he hit falling down yesterday or two days ago. This guy's good. This guy is good. Love it. All right. Auto here. De La Cruz, Stott, Ramos, and... Brandon can't sign it. Can't sign in the right spot. Brandon Hallett. More draft cards. But huge hit. Two huge hits so far. Uh, we're still we're not that far into this break. The so Robert Purple to 20 and the Dominguez Purple auto to 250. Two damn good hits. All right, here we go. Box three. Javier, Chisholm, Rollison, Gray, Gonzalez, Adamin, Marquez, Denneberg, Mata, Garcia, Levine. A very nice Bobby Witt. Adams, Montero, Floriel, Jones, Shortridge, Mitchell, Whitley, Hose, Bayron, Laura. Wyatt, there you go. No problem, Kev. That's you, the Robert. Congrats, man, if that is. Uh, Sejas, Garcia, Vaughn, Bennett, and Manning. Orange. Aloris Montero. 63 of 75. Nice card. I say very nice a lot. Very nice. Nice card. Nice hit. <laughs> Luis Sanchez, John Diaz, and Zach Hess. More cards for the draft spot. Ah, oh, one Wyatt. You're the only two Wyatts I know outside of Wyatt from... <laughs> What's it called? Uh, Ozark. So, yeah. You're Wyatt and other Wyatt. 
But both of those names pertains to both of you because I, I technically I don't know who would just be regular Wyatt. Team Wyatt in the house. More here. Four. So a million, uh, all of our breaks are uh, filled on the blowout cards forums currently. Um, if you're not a member, it's free to sign up. We've got uh, over 50,000 members there, I believe. Um, all you got to do is go to blowoutcards.com backslash forums, fill out the, uh, the sign up, and you'll get approved in a couple days. And then uh, from there, you just go to the group break sections and join whatever break you want. If uh, one of you guys out there wouldn't mind sending a uh, or posting a link real quick to the forums for uh, Jacob there, I'd appreciate it. All right, here we go with box four. Mauricio Apostle, another Luis Robert. Lots of Luis Robert dollars here today. Astudillo, Langoliers, Kraus, Sanchez, Ryan, Wilson, Thompson, Hall, Pache, Bishop, Dominguez is coming, Huff, J-Rod, Valmont, Beck, Mize, Miller, Ashby, Garcia, Hoke, Cruz, Volpe, Dominguez is, he's in here somewhere, he's gotta be, yep, here he comes, Hernandez and Dominguez, more dollars for Chris, make it rain, Chris, Amaya and our orange is... Mata? Nope. Tanner Hoke. Tanner Hoke. 17 to 75. All right. Let's see if we can get an auto for one of you guys that actually has a player spot. Uh, Freeman, McConnell, Pereira, and... Nope. Can't do it. Mario Feliciano. Box five. Hoke, okay, there we go. Like, I'm having fun opening more Sapphire, guys. I really am, but I can't even like stress to you how excited I am for 16 Optic Football to open that. One of my favorite products of all time. Well, we got one now. Ha ha! Let's go! All right. All right, here's the play. All right, everyone, here's what we're doing. Giveaway time. Giveaway time! All right, let me find something to give away first. 
Hmm, what do I have? Where are the cards that I just bought? Baseball stuff. Nothing good, though. Hmm. Hmm. Hold on a second, guys. I'll find something here. I'll find something. No, that's not good enough. It's all basketball. I buy too much basketball stuff. Hmm. 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 This stuff. Here we go. This is what I'll do. What's one of these cards? There's a couple baseball cards in here, right? Okay. All right. Here we go. All right. All right. All right. Oh. Whoa, camera. What on earth did you do while I got up? Holy Jesus. All right, well, the giveaway contest here is, I got 24 people watching, uh, guess our pad paracha. You guess our pad paracha, you're going to win this card that you can't see because my camera just quit on us. Literally is focused one inch away. Look at all those lines on my hand, though. This is the card you're going to win. A Brandon Lau or Low Optic White Sparkle Rookie. I'm just going to have to clear everything out. So there's the Pad Paraja stack. I'm just going to move it off to the back for right now uh, just to try and get the camera to refocus here. So go ahead, get your guesses in. Um, we're going to do it at the end here. Actually, we'll do it to make sure everyone can get their guesses in because I don't know how far behind we are. We'll go through both stacks this box and the next box before the uh, contest ends. So we'll do it at the end. So you guess it, you get it right. I'll send you this nice cool card. Brandon Lowe, Donruss Optic, White Sparkle Rookie, now that we're back in focus. First and last names, please, everyone, for your guesses. There are a couple guys who share last names. All right. So here is uh, the other part of box five. Rutledge. Now that we're back in focus. Schmidt, Freeman, McConnell, Bojarski, Gore, Sanchez, Joe Ryan, Pena, uh, Abrams, Hall, Pache, Unbeliever, here comes another Dominguez. Robinson, Liberator, Hernandez. There it is. Chris, man. Whew. Remember me come Christmas time, buddy. <laughs> another Dominguez. Henderson, Groshans, J-Rod, Valamont, Lodolo, Javier, Miller, and Ashby. Autograph. Wow. Another Luis Robert, too. Asadio, Howard, and the auto. Nice one. Xavier Edwards. Who's got the Xavier Edwards spot? I saw someone post in the thread. That they had this. So whoever it is, congratulations. Nice card. And Xavier Edwards. Let me uh, sleeve these guys up right quick. And I apologize. Going a little slow here. I just want to sleeve all this stuff since I'm giving it to my wife. Probably not going to give her the stack of Sapphire cards just in case. <laughs> the expensive ones. <laughs> uh, it's a non-auto sports card market, just so you guys know. It is definitely a non-auto because it's facing forward. So... No way. Chris has... Oh, my God. <laughs> Unbelievable. Wow. He's going to love watching this video. I don't even know if he's seen the random yet, but boy, is he going to enjoy it. But yeah, Pad Paracha is a non-auto, guys. It's definitely a non-auto. I think he does. I think uh, there is Ruth Chris in my future on uh, on not me. 
Uh, we'll see, Kev. I, I think uh, <laughs> I think uh, Chris got you beat a little bit as far as um, <laughs> steak dinners owed. Because he hit like a uh, he went crazy too in the beginning of uh, these breaks. Not on Sapphire. It was a uh, Bowman first edition. He hit the Yankees like seven times out of like the twenty five rounds or eight times, and he was on. He wasn't even in every round. He was in like I think like thirteen of them. It was it was unbelievable. And he got the Yankees in a. Uh, one of the regular Bowman breaks. He's hit the Yankees a lot. Guy is hot right now. But if that Rob, if that Robert, if that's the Pad Paracha Robert, then you're in the lead for steak dinners. So, come on, Luis Robert. That's my guess. I just, I'll do anything for free food. I'm such a, such a food hooker. All right. <laughs> Rodriguez, Tavares, Levine. Another nice Bobby Witt. Nova, Terang, Whitley, Hose, Paredes, India, Laura. I think it's our second Sapphire Laura. Sejas, Amaya, Mendoza, Bennett, Manning, Dahlbeck, Pardino, Waters, Jung, Beer, Boz, Little, White, Duran, Bart, Smith, and Luciano. And last chance, guys. Get your guesses in. Get those guesses in right now. We're going to be doing the Pad Paracha here in about 20 seconds. Floriel, Jones, and Hines. And... Oh, there's a nice one. Who's got the Sam Huff spot? Sam Huff Auto. Who's got that? That's someone. All right. Just be someone good. Be someone real good. De La Cruz. Stott. And I don't know if it's upside down or not. It is... Okay, it is upside down. Hmm, I think I know who it is. And it's not a first Bowman, but I think it's a good second year Bowman. How about that? Well, third year Bowman, right? He's 2018. Jared Kalenic. Hey yo. Yeah, he was 2018, not 2019. That's my bad. I I I I goofed that one. No. <laughs> so that's a nice one. I'd be happy with that. Guy rakes. Which is why the Mets traded him for a bag of peanuts. For the worst closer in the majors. And a guy on steroids. Let's go, Mets. Do your thing. A Hunter Bishop probably would have been nicer, at least for you, Corey. You got you didn't do too bad, Corey. Uh Bishop and um Joe Ryan. I like Joe Ryan. Other people like Joe Ryan too. He's one of the better pitchers you can uh get, honestly. From, a, from this product, so guy strikes people out like a lot, like a lot alright grab a couple more boxes here so no one won the Brandon Lau back to the stack of dumb crap that I buy on eBay when I'm drinking, it goes But we'll play again. If we get another one, we'll play again, and I will I will add another card in. Sorry I didn't have anything better than that sitting around here. I did a little bit of cleaning, so. All right, Chris, I mean, that's not too much to ask. I think I can do it. Second Terry Bradshaw parallel. I think I can do that. I think I pulled two out of Bowman Draft last year. Grant Gambrel and uh, someone else. Oh, well, good luck, B-Man. I appreciate you joining. I hope you're enjoying your uh, first break in a while. Rutledge is another good one. Love me some Jackson Rutledge. I think you've got a fair amount of uh, his base already. I feel like I remember calling his name at least five or six times, so... 
All right, on to box six here of Sapphire. Sapphire. That's true, Corey. It doesn't matter the players you get if I don't pull any of them. <laughs> that is a fair assessment. And while we're uh, sitting here tearing through these packs, uh, I do have a couple breaks up right now if anyone is interested. Um, I have a soccer break up. Soccer cards, if you have not noticed, are s absolutely on fire. Um, so we have a Chronicles breakup, um, half case, it's about $50 a spot for a random team. And then we also have, uh, what is the other thing I put, oh, a nice Prism Football Mixer. It's uh, one box of 2019 Prism Football Hobby and one white sparkle pack from 2018. So chances of Lamar Jackson and some other big rookies there, uh, if you guys are interested. And I will have something else Bowman related up once this break concludes. Um, and then we will have a basketball mixer uh, that is on the horizon uh, in the next day or two. So, I'll also have a Walking Dead break. Cheap, uh, cheap hit draft. So, test them on the waters. Just dip in my feet and just right into the water, uh, seeing how that goes. All right. Grayson Rodriguez, Tavares, Miller, Ashby, Nova, Terrain, Gil, Thomas, Paredes, India, Franco, Welker, Amaya, Mendoza, Ruiz, Cavico, Dahlbeck, Pardino, Balazovic, Baum, Beer, Boz, Davis, Swaggerty, Duran, Bart, Rollison, and Gray. No numbered card in this box, but our auto. Cruz, Volpe, Hines. Hey, who wanted Grant Little? Someone said Grant Little. There he is. Grant Little. Are you coming for me, sweetie? What the fudge? Here, just take the box lid. Oh, and there was one up there that didn't have a number on it. It had BCP. It yeah, that's okay. Just put that one off to the side. God, what happened while I was gone? We opened a lot of cards. Is this it? For now. How many boxes are there? Uh, those on the floor. Oh. <sighs> we'll make dinner. You can make dinner if you want. She sorts my cars and cooks my food. That is my wife. Dun, dun, dun. Nice, Dana. Yeah. She is MVP level today. That's for damn sure. Ah, oh, I can't sort those cards because I gotta cook dinner. <laughs> What a dream. Fantastic. Uh, so we got the dreaded three card pack. Uh, we noticed that a couple times in boxes that were missing um, parallels and no parallel, three card pack, so bummer. But I don't think there's really anything we can do about it since they're not guaranteed, so. All right, Rushman, another Luis Robert. Mmm, mmm, tasty. Asudio, Whole Sizer, Freeman, McConnell, Trammell, Scoobal, Sanchez, Ryan, Carlson, Mountcastle, Hall, Pache, here it comes again. Dunning, Singer, J Rod, Valamont, Mauricio, Apostle, Miller, Ashby, Pereira, Langoliers, Cruz, and Volpe. Got to be in the auto pack, right? Yep. Hernandez. Dominguez. Another one. Pearson. And hey, there's a good one. Who's got Miguel Vargas? Who's got the Miguel Vargas spot? Yeah. If she cooked the cards, I'd probably... Um, we'd have to have a family discussion there would be a new therapist in our life very expensive one <laughs> and the and dinner would taste like crap so just like terrible all around luckily there's no sorting table anywhere near the kitchen 
I think we're making some kind of a some kind of chicken. A little bit of bird tonight. Another three card pack. I didn't notice it if uh, in the box or two before this. It took me a while to notice it um, when that was happening in the last round of Sapphire we did. It was like two or three boxes, all three cards, three cards, three cards, no, uh, no numbered cards. So hopefully that's the end of it, it's those couple boxes there. But Paritas, India, Whitley, Hose, Amaya, Mendoza, Laura. Sejas, Dalvik, Pardino, Bennett, Manning, Boer, uh, Boer, Seth Boer, Seth Beer, Waters, Jung, Duran, Bart, Smith, Luciano, Cancio, Howard, De La Cruz, Stott, Rutledge, Schmidt, another one. Wow. What is that, six of them? Is that six Roberts and Astudio? Or five? It's five or six of both him and uh, Dominguez at this point, I think. Little, White, Boz, and... Another Lindsay Delgado. This time it's the Sapphire version for the draft. So right now we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I think we've got 13 spots in the draft right now. 13 spots in the draft. Quick half, half a second here to... Uh, continue the soft sleeve life that I'm living. Yeah, Robert and Dominguez spots are both just absolutely dominating. Shout out to the top spots. I mean, just keep doing work. I feel like there's a Robert in every box. All right. Kind of feels like that to me, Chris. But I think I, I think it just might be uh, it just might be my boxes that I've been getting. I've been doing this so long. It's not intentional, but a lot of times there'll be um, things just run together. I don't know why. Um, there's been products where we've had where we've you know had you know RPAs to 99. There's 100 cards, and we've never seen 30 of them despite opening you know 200 cases in our store. But we've gotten, you know, 10 to 12 copies of 40 different guys, you know. And that's just kind of how it feels to me with this. Is like, yeah, you know, we're hitting some wits, some plasons, some Loras. But I feel like we're just, we keep hitting the run of box that has Dominguez and Robert over and over and over again. Which, again, sample size. I mean, over the amount of boxes that they made and what we've opened. Could just be an anomaly. Could just be getting a little bit lucky. Could be that they divvy those guys up, um, either intentionally or unintentionally, in the, the print run, and we just happened to get a set of boxes here that had had that side. But either way, I'm happy about it. times I remember that were not it was not the players that you wanted it was a uh, 13 14 national treasures I think we pulled like 30 of the Alex Lennon TRPAs out of our store out of the 99 uh, so that wasn't great and then in 13 14 um, national treasures hockey I mean so much of that so much that we saw opened and never one single Nathan McKinnon and same thing with 13 14 cup oh my god I did it again Chris, I did it for you. You wanted two, you got two. Game's back on. Let's do it, boys. Guess the pad paracha. 
It's going to be a non-auto again. Um, I never saw a Nathan McKinnon RPA out of hundreds and hundreds of cases of 13-14 Cup and uh, NT. So. All right, I'm going to have to find something else to give away now. God damn it. If anyone picks Jared Klenick, you're an idiot. Uh, but it will make me laugh. Let me find something to give away real fast. In addition to the Brandon Lau. How about... What is this stack of stuff? I don't even know what's over here. Nah. What's in this box? Nothing good. What's in this box? No baseball. What's in here? Baseball? Nope. Oh, there we go. This will have something in it. All right. Found stuff with baseball. guys would be incredulous if you just saw the stuff that I had sitting over here not in sleeves. Because I don't have a lot of Bowman stuff. A lot of this stuff is just dumb crap. Okay, here, that's fine. We'll use that. And that too, because I don't even know if he's good anymore. Why not? All right. Just more random cards to give away. All right. Okay. Okay, so we're still going to give away this Brandon Lau. And then random stuff. I know this guy was a top pick. Don't know if he's any good anymore. Cornelius Randolph. I don't think he is, but whatever. Don't care. But then we got a nice little uh, mega box and uh, paper Vlad Jr. Mega box has got to be good, right? 2018. That's got to be okay. Whatever. So, all right. There's a nice little stack of stuff that we're going to give away if anyone can guess the Pad Paracha correctly. All right. A lot of guesses over there. So I will uh, go back and check them before we reveal. But here we go. Yeah, I had a Mel Ott 33 Gaudi rookie sitting there in no sleeve. Same thing with Carl Hubber, uh, Carl Hubble. 33 Gaudi Hall of Fame rookies, no sleeve. There's a Bo Burrow Super Factor Auto in that box. No sleeve. Whoops. All right, Mauricio, Apostle, Marquez, Denenberg, Langoliers, Kraus, Florial, Jones, Wilson, Thompson, Whitley, Hose, Amaya, Bishop, Laura, Sejas, Beck, Mize, Waters, Jung, Garcia, Hoke, Little, and Evan White. Levine, Witt, Pereira. Hey, there we go. Now we're starting to hit some names. Tariq Scoobs. Little Scoob Doobs. Nice hit there. Thanks, Wyatt. I do have a very nice aura about myself. Aha! Try and, you know, set the uh, set the atmosphere, a little feng shui. All right. Ha ha, gotcha. Got him with the wordplay. I think we got another Wit Laura box coming up here. And I think we got our first numbered auto as well from Sapphire. And another number card. Now we're back on track. Back on track. Let's get it. And I think I'm probably going to run back uh, <laughs> the Wyatt spots just hit together. 
Um, I think I'm going to run back something similar to this break where it's going to be, uh, it might be more Sapphire and Mega Box orient, uh, oriented than uh, having the Bowman Hobby in there. I don't know. i got to run some numbers, but um, I feel like this break is going pretty well so far. So, All right. Kirilov, Vargas, Whitley, Hose, Green, uh, Allen. There's Laura. Sejas, Encarnacion, Hayes, Bennett, Manning, Poisson. Wyatt, Wyatt, Gilbert, Waters, Jung, Brown, Cameron, Levine. Oh, there's the other Wyatt. Bobby Witt, Hankins, Madrigal, Floriel, and Jones. Our orange is Lewis, Sanchez, Kate, and... Kiebert Ruiz, 1 of 75. A purple little derpature. Marquez, Deneberg, Cabello, and... Hey, hey, there it is. I told you this guy's good and I always pull him. Where you at, Corey? Love it. Joe Ryan, orange, 8 of 25. Banger. That's a good card. Good card, right? Yeah. That's got to cover both your spot prices and then somebody. Congratulations. All right, one last reminder. Uh, all this random stuff that I have over here that I'm giving away, make your guesses on the Pad Paracha base one of one that's up here. You guys get it right. If someone gets it right, you will win a couple of Vlad Jr. rookies, uh, Brandon Lowe or Lau, can't remember. Uh, White Sparkle, and a Cornelius Randolph 2015 Bowman Draft Auto. There's an orange. And our auto. We're revealing the Terry Bradshaw parallel here in just a minute. Rodriguez, Tavares, Little, White, Terang, Paredes, another one, another one. You know what that means. Here comes Dominguez. Wow, dude. You're running hot. Look at that. See, even though you don't think you're doing that well, you're still running hot. Astudio, India, Amaya, Freeman, McConnell, Mendoza, Dahlbeck, Sanchez, Joe Ryan, Pardino, Beer, Hall, Pache, Baz, Duran, Hernandez, and there he is, j Dog. Whew, crazy. All right. De La Cruz, Stott, Nova, and Hunter Green. Ah, oh, Nick Lodolo. I thought Hunter Green had his arm raised. Maybe it's facing the other way. Nick Lodolo, 48 of 75 for the Nick Lodolo spot. Autograph, Cannon Smith, Luciano, and Hines, and... Ah, bad. Diesel Bell, Arias. Bad, bad, bad. Pretty sure he is, well, he is draftable. All right, let me scroll up and take a look at all these guesses here. As we get to reveal our Terry Bradshaw one of one. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Second one here out of 16 boxes after we didn't hit one in like 90. All right, our guesses were... All right, here we go. Sixto Sanchez, Gus Varland, Scoogle, Garcia, Rushman, Holsizer, Cabello, Green, Schmidt, Bishop, Thomas, Cardenas, Pena. Abram, you got a, uh, you want Alec Thomas? I'm giving you Alec Thomas because you picked him twice. Or Rushman, you got to pick one. Can't pick all of them, Abe. Come on, bro. <laughs> uh, Taylor Trammell, Nick Madrigal, Shane Boz. Okay, like the whole thing is picked. I feel like every prospect has been picked, but uh, if you pick more than one, Fix it and pick one right now. I'll give you guys like 20 seconds. 20 seconds as I reveal the more important top cards. Nick Bennett, Matt Manning, Sam Huff. Very nice. All right, Adley is your one. Last time it was upside down. All 
All right, it's a batting helmet, and it's blue. I think we're going to go unguessed. We're going to go unguessed because this team only has two players in the set, and no one said either one of them, I believe. It's either going to be a first Bowman or a good second Bowman. It's the first Bowman. Of the big fatty Wilfred Astudio. Let's go Mets. LGM. There it is. I don't think anyone said Wilfred. Right? No one said Mauricio. I know that. Did someone say Wilfred? I don't think so. No. All right. I get to keep all those cards. Unfortunately... Back in the box they go. But Wilfred Astudio off the board. The Terry Bradshaw, one of one. One of one. One of one, very nice. All right. Final four boxes here. We'll get another one. I'll add to the stack. Final four. So Duke, Kansas, Villanova, and uh, eh, like Gonzaga. If it was Joe Janord, I literally would have. I would have pulled a, who was that, Platinum Card Break that destroyed the Lowry Marketing? Yeah, I, I probably would have, I probably would have, I, pro, yeah, I, I would have, I, oh, I can't even come up with the words that I want to speak because it makes me so annoyed to think. If that was Joe Janord, thank God he didn't have a non-auto. Once I saw the uh, the helmet, I, I kind of saw the orange peeking out a little bit and I knew we were going to be okay because it was either Mauricio or the first Bowman. But that's just such a shame to, like, you know, see that, like, that card peeking out. Like, you see a Super Fractor Auto or, like, a Pad Paratch Auto peeking out at you, and you, like, know, like, all right, you know, this is one of, like, the... This could be it. This could be, like, you know, the pull of a lifetime if it's the right guy, like, that... That big-time lottery ticket. It's, like, hitting, like, a Logo Man Auto in basketball, and you just see it, and you're just like, oh, my God, please, please, and then it's the worst player in the set, and you just... It's so devastating. It's soul crushing. Like, soul crushing. This is the only word I can, uh, or phrase that I can come up with. Like, because I've had that happen to me many a time where I'm just like, oh my God. Just one time. One time. You know, for this $25,000, $30,000, $50,000 potential. And then it's like, it's the Jojen Ord of whatever the product is. It hurts. I mean, it's still good. Still, usually at least something worth something, but oof. I feel like Judge Nord shouldn't even get a Pad Paratia or a Super Fractor. I feel like the the unprinted paper, the Super Fractor pattern with no image on it, is probably worth more than having Judge Nord's face plastered across it. Hate that guy. All right, auto. Doesn't look like we're getting a numbered card this time, but we also didn't have any cards missing, so that's nice. Final four boxes. Singer, Mauricio, Waters, Jung, Pereira, Langlier, Smith, Luciano, Kraus, Wilson, De La Cruz, Stott, Thompson, Amaya. Doot, 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 doot. Add it to the pile. Asudio, Bishop, Huff, Freeman, McConnell, Beck, Mize, Sanchez, Ryan, Garcia, Hoke, Hall, Pache. Did we get another one? Is he in the autograph spot? He is not. Wow. Little, white, and apostle. So we got a we got the run of them, but the we missed by one pack, the Dominguez. But there's a nice one. Uh, I mean, Joe Janor might kill me one day, honestly. I've been trashing him nonstop for like eight straight breaks. Probably a nice guy. Like, I just don't want your autograph. So you're welcome to come over and barbecue with us, Joe Janor, if you're out there. Like, I'm sure, you know, we'll bro down. We'll chug some beers, whatever, have a good time, but Next time they ask you to sign, just be like, take one for the team. Be like, I I'm good. We good. Meanwhile, real good card here, Robbie Poiss. 
So that's a big one. Congratulations to whoever has that. Another big card coming out of this break. Got a Poisson Auto, the Dominguez Purple Auto, uh, the Joe Ryan Orange Auto to 25, um, the Robert Purple to 20, um, and then probably, I don't know, 10, it feels like 10. Uh, the Poisson Centering, mm, a little, mm, close. It looks like a touch off both ways. A t I mean a touch. It's probably like 55-45 both ways. Definitely left to right. It might be 50-50 top to bottom. But yeah, it's well. It's good. Nothing that's going to... Nothing that will uh, prevent any potential grade on, uh, on that front. I have one complaint about this break. I'd like to see more numbered autos here out of Sapphire. I've only gotten one out of, uh, this is going to be our, what, 14th box? Uh, Hill, Ramos, Cruz, Volpe, Davidson, Rushman, Franco, Welker, Holsizer, Trammel, Balazovic, Bomb, Skubal, Carlson, Davis, Swaggerty, Mountcastle, Pearson, Rollison, Gray, Dunning, Singer, Lewis, and Sanchez. Ruiz, Cavico, and Brian Campusano. Oh, I forgot about him. Oh, that would have been bad if it was Brian Campusano. I forgot he's in here. The Pat Paraggio is him. And Austin Beck to 75. Orange, that is 31 of 75. Gil, Thomas, and Blade and our auto. Oh my god. Alright. Chris, you're gonna get a PM from me with my my order my wife's order too uh sorry you're buying dinner for both of us um so we're just gonna pick we're gonna pick somewhere that you can order from online from your own location and uh, you just you just let me know you're gonna message me back tomorrow and say hey your dinner will be ready for pickup at 5 p.m um at this location thank you so much you're the best breaker on earth uh very good person um and uh yeah that's that's how we're gonna do this that's how we're gonna play the next uh, 24 hours me and you. So it was nice negotiating. <laughs> I promise we will uh, we'll take it easy on you. We'll take it easy. You know, we'll order like we were going out to eat ourselves. Not gonna throw like five dinners on there or anything like that, you know. Maybe like Texas Roadhouse. Delicious but affordable, you know? My goodness. Ooh, okay, so this is an interesting pack. We got Wyatt. The Wyatt box, and we got a green auto. So finishing strong here. I think I'll roll with maybe a. I go with the steak and ribs. A little steak and rib action. Sauce on the side for them ribs. Um, vegetables, definitely. Definitely veg. Possibly a uh, house salad. Vinegar for my dressing. No tomatoes. Extra egg. I think, I think that's my how. That might be how I roll. I can say the wife. She'll probably go with the uh, six ounce fillet, the Dallas fillet, medium, butterflied. Um, she will probably also get a house salad. Extra croutons and uh, yeah, you know she can go either way. Probably baked. I would say baked potato. Sometimes she gets mashed, but baked potato cheese and bacon so yeah and don't forget to tip okay chris be nice come on those people are working hard all right lutz edwards whitley hose cardenas rutherford white box sejas manoa adele waters jung gorman varlin little white anderson win marquez denneberg perez lynch floriel and jones bennett manning casas and Oscar Gonzalez, 24 75. Orange. And our green auto, Levine. There's our wit. 
Hunter Green. I'm so happy to just <laughs> Oh, son of a bitch. All right, last box. That was such like a promising like setup for a great ending, a Dominguez, a green auto, and another Joe Genord, of course. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, last box, last box. Honestly, that that's gonna be a high pick because it's number to fifty. It's not gonna be a bad pick. That might go like number three or something. I don't know. Alright, <laughs> here we go. Chisholm, John Diaz, Cruz, Volpe, Adam and Mata, Franco, Welker, Adams, Montero, Balzovich, Baum, Shortridge, Mitchell, Davis, Swaggerty, Jones, Garcia, Rollison, Gray, Vaughn, Mateo, Lewis, and Sanchez. All right, our orange. I think it's Jackson Rutledge. I saw it. Yep. Sorry, I kind of ruined that one by bad card handling, but Jackson Rutledge for... I don't remember who had Jackson Rutledge. Shouldn't have done it, Steve. You done did it. <laughs> but nice Jackson Rutledge there, 42 of 75 for someone that's watching. I can't remember who it was. But there you go. There's your Rutledge that I spoke of. Uh, Gil, Thomas, Gonzalez, and just one time, anyone but the Mets. Thank God. All right, Damon Jones. So Damon Jones. I'm pretty sure he's a regular spot. Um... All right, Damon Jones is a regular spot. Okay, I think he is. It's like the only one I don't remember that we've hit. Um, someone let me know about Damon Jones. I'm pretty sure he's a regular spot. But I'm going to just go ahead and count off. Okay, I thought so. I'm going to count off the um, spots that we have here, and then we're going to redo that random to figure out the draft order. Uh, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven autos. And then I just want to double check the wording about the parallels and stuff. So give me half a second here. Um, okay. Uh, second random. All rookie card logos. Those are all together. Okay, and the paper's together. Okay, yeah, so that's what I thought. Okay, so four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So we have 15 draftable spots. 15 draftable spots. So let me get the list. I'm gonna have to just re uh, do it here to put it back in order. One through 150. I have a second here. Let me do all that. We'll do that random. Uh, data. Let's sort range. Z. One second here, guys. It's going to take me a minute to do this. Just because I got to filter out all the stuff that, uh, is in between in the hundreds, mixes it up with the teens.
almost done. Almost done, guys. Two more seconds, and then we will be ready. Okay, that should be everything. Okay, cool. All right, we got it now. All right, so our list is reformatted and fixed. So I'm going to go ahead and switch us on over to uh, the random view. All right. So we got 150 names here. So the top 15 of you are going to get to draft something. Um, just... Uh, in case I made a mistake, which I don't think I did. Let me just double check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, it should be 15. Um, so like 99.9% .9 sure it's 15. Um, but just if you have spot 15 or 16, just be on alert that in case there's something that I mixed up somewhere, just put in the wrong stack or whatever, um, there may be one more or one less, but I'm 99.9% .9 sure it's 15. So here we go, though, seven times. Good luck, guys. One... Two, make sure it's 150, okay, good. Three, four, five, six, and seven. All right, so. Copy this over. So, Brad, you got the first pick. Good looking kid at two. Kid Rock with three. Craig with four. Steve with five. Dios with six. Manny with seven. Paper Chase with eight. Kid Kicks with nine. Chris with 10. Chris SR with 11. Kid Rock at 12. Prince with 13. Bean Man at 14. And Manny at 15 is going to do it. So, that's going to be our uh, 15 draft spots. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So. That's going to do it. All right, guys. I am going to um, cut the video here. I'm going to run upstairs and just bring this last little bit up to my wife, and then I'm going to take a two-minute break, and then we'll get started um, probably right after 7 o'clock with uh, Optic Football. All right, guys. Thanks so much. I hope you enjoyed it. Chris, you're rich. <laughs> Later, guys.